They are very crafty. Hardly you will, will you see them sick of stress because they know how to manage themselves. They know how to manage their time. But we, the Bible says he uses the things of the world to conform the wise. When we, are, when we engage in little strength, you say, I'm tired. I cannot pray. God understands. And by so doing, you begin to fall short. You begin to lose your dream. You begin to lose your prophecy. You begin to lose your dedication. You no longer have time for God because God has answered part of your prayer. Look at Ezekiel prophesy. And dry bone became flesh, but there was no life. And this is where many people, you know, this is where many people say, I'm okay with this one. I prophesy and dry bone became flesh. This is an advancement, a great achievement. And then this is where people start. But Ezekiel said, yes, the first miracle has taken place. Then what about the completeness of that testimony? What is happening? There is no bread. The same way you pray that God answered the first prayer, he can answer the second prayer. I don't care what you're going through. This pain is much. Man. This agony is great. Lord, how long will I continue like this? If only you prayed like you prayed the first time. Then you will get the answer. And so he had another voice and said, prophesy. The same way. Prophesy. And then he prophesied and there was life. I want you to tell Man. the Lord. That the Lord will send back revival fire into your spirit. The Amen. spirit that prays, the spirit that intercedes, the spirit that has alignment with his maker, that the Holy Spirit will send into your life. Somebody open your mouth and pray. A great God in heaven. We are the tired of God losing signs. I surrender myself. And some people say I want to marry God. because they want to marry. You, you will go and meet a prophet. Prophet, let me check it. Is it okay? The question is, why can't you pray? They that know their God shall be strong and do as well. That prophet is a human like you. Elijah of like passion said there will be no rain in the space of three and a half years. There will be no rain. I know and there were no rain. Elijah commanded fire, he came Elijah. from nowhere. Satan, Can you pay that price and see if those signs will not come back? God you need God. to carry fire. The, Holy One, the people want to see fire am, of God in you. The, one that says, the people yes, want no to see illumination God in you. He ah, carry fire. He carry anointing. You need to you need to make the people see it. Let it reflect through your character. Let it reflect in your prayer life. Let me you pray small time, then you are tired. Communion on daily basis in the mighty name when of last Jesus you Christ. Say I want to go for, for visitation. Silence by prayer. I want to go and win soul for Christ. Christ. In the name of Jesus. And the Lord Christ. is counting on you. We keep asking God, give me this, give me this, give me this, but yet we are not ready to pay any sacrifice. In the name of Jesus and it shall come to pass in that day that I will pour my out my spirit upon all flesh. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I shall not backslide. I shall not weaken out. I in will be Jesus stretchy. Name we I will pray. receive the fire in Jesus' name. Amen. I want to tell you something. Do you know that there are a lot of promises in the Bible? I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you. Amen. You will not die, but live to serve the Lord. They that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. Bless me, your coming in and your going out. There are a lot of promises Amen. in the Bible. But the point is, you will now ask yourself, why am I not experiencing it? Let me quickly tell you, God can never lie in his promise. And there are no promises given unto you in the Bible or somebody prophesy and say you, in the next two years, God is taking you to a high place. You just discover that in two years, you did not see it happen. Uh -huh. As a man of God lied, no. For every prophecy needed a prayer. 
Everything yes. God said, I will do, I will do, I will do. You need prayer to bring it to manifestation. That yes. admission, I will give it to you. That uh, marriage, you've been looking for spouse, you've been looking for wife, you're looking for husband, looking for who to marry, that delay. And say, God said, I will do it within the space of three months. And then you say, that one is settled. After all, God has said it. And there are no prayer to bring it to manifestation. Those things are in spirit. There is nothing you do in the spirit. If you do not work hard, it will not manifest in the physical. And so when there are promises, it is spiritual. And then you have to pray and bring it to manifestation. Amen. Say, I will give you long life. You will not die. Amen. You just discover. God say you will not die. But there are no faith to receive it. There are no prayer to accept it. There are no confirmations to say yes. And then the next thing you see the person die. Ah, pastor, but you say this person will not die. There are no power that backs it all. No prayer of affirmation. Today you are going to pray. What is it that has affected your, your faith? David said, bring the effort. Where was the effort when David began to cry that everything has been taken away from me? Do not let the enemy just cheat you and take away what you deserve from the, from, from the kingdom. You are going to pray today. And say, Lord, I am open up to you. I receive your promise. You say you will pour out your spirit upon all flesh. I am ready for the outpouring. Ah, I am ready for outpouring of fire. I am ready for outpouring of power. I am ready for outpouring from on high. Somebody open your mouth and begin to pray. Oh God, my Father, I am that I pray am. for the outpouring. You will be quoted. You will be signed. Outpouring of the Holy Ghost. Lord, I am Release ready. your power God, in the greater way. Release I'm your power. Ready. You receive fire of power to pray. You see people prophesy. They life. pay the price. They don't just sit down. They pray to manifestation. For me with they will come to you. See what the Lord has said. Some people go, you know, when God me, was God. calling uh, Samuel, me. Samuel could not decipher that this is the voice of God. God help me. In the name of Even though Jesus he saw God, he prayed. Glorify yourself. How to go and meet Eli? Stress you call me? No, pray. I don't call you. I, 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 I'm not calling you. Oh, that's right. When back again, you, you call me? No. Well. wasn't calling you. Now Jesus Eli understood. Father, help me. Glorify yourself. As long as you begin to hear from him, but you pay price to hear it from him. You can't just sit down in your luxury and say, God has done it. And say, God Lord, promised me, and then he will bring it to pass. Me. You have help to pray it to manifestation. I need somebody to pray. I need somebody to pray. Oh, my God. I need your touch. I need your revival. I need your pouring of the Holy Spirit of me. But that ministry is not manifesting. God, I am not You are not seeing it working for you. I need that atmosphere of fire. I can't check what is happening. I need that atmosphere of fire. How is your prayer life? I need that atmosphere of fire. In the mighty name How much do you pray? I need that. How much do you prayer. fast? In my do you life, have time for God? Life, I want the gift of the, gift of the Spirit. Life, it will come to pass in that day. In yes, life. this is what the word of the Lord said. Everybody is supposed to have it. You have it when you ask of it. You ask it when you are desperate for it. Let me tell you, the non-challenge are being possessed of the spirit of the devil. Christ, I will pour out my spirit upon you. Devil, I will pour out my Spirit upon you, and there are demons everywhere. Fire in prayer. You see them terrorizing our territory. They have invaded our churches. They are mounting up the pulpit because people have opened themselves for the outpouring of the devil. And we pour out my spirit upon all flesh. And, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. Don't you see people with divinations? 
Oh no, open the door. They will come and they will come and divine for you. Ah, the spirit of God is in this person. No, sir. That is not correct. It is the spirit of divination, the spirit of Belzebub. Your young man shall see vision. What they have concluded in the spiritual, they will come back to come and tell you. Ah, please, so you need to be very well. I see Aki. I see Aki in a pool of blood. Something they have already concluded. And then in the next three days, I can begin to get sick. Hey, that prophet said it all. He's not a prophet, he's working with the spirit of Belzebub. And how do we eliminate this territory from our own territory if you will not pray? If you are hopeful to God, He uses you, He uses your family, uses them, and then you begin to reach out to people. By the time you change your family, I change my family, everyone changes. Is his family, the devil will have no power in this territory. Your sons and your daughters shall prophesy. How good will it be? Look at your family and see them prophesy. Daddy, this is what the Lord says. You see them prophesy. And you see your young man. Oh, I saw this. This is what I saw. And your old man dreamed it. Don't go there. That thing you said you want to do is not the best place for you to go. They find a life. They were not playing. They were ready to pay the blind price. They were not tired. They saw God's face and they got it. If you will see God's face tonight, you will get it. A pouring of God's power. It will pour down His spirit. His power upon your spirit, upon your soul. Where are your signs? They can easily come and deceive you. They say, I am not a witch. They say, I'm a witch, but I am not a witch. You, there is not how you can even confirm. Pastor, I had a dream yesterday. And they will tell you the dream. You cannot even interpret the dream. You say, don't worry. Everything is in God. Let us pray. Or maybe the dream is telling you that that journey you want to go, uh, you, you, you don't, don't just try it so that you will not go. Don't, 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 don't just try it. I need you. A woman came to me sometimes ago and said, Pastor, I'm following my uh, neighbor. We want to go and do their uh, mother's burial ceremony. Pastor, can I go? He said, Why not? Why can't you go? Come, let me pray for you. He said, Pastor, wait a moment. Ah, uh, there are some prophets that said they saw blood, full of blood, accident on the way, and head were rolled on the floor, and all that. That's why I came to meet you, Pastor, so that you help me check very well. I smile. I say, Come, let me pray for you. You will go and you will come back. And then she went. She, she, she left. So the other time when I came back, ah, she began to roll on the ground. Pastor, thank you, sir. People say, If I go and come back, people say this one and that. Where are your sons, brothers, and sisters? Is the journey good? Is the journey not good? Will it be accidental? They come to meet you, Pastor. See my wife. Pray for us. This is my fiance, and I want to marry her. Should I go ahead? This is my husband. Should I go ahead? Will you not make me a punchy bag? And you say, come, come, come. Then you look at them. They were smiling. Oh, how we love them. How we love each other. No, this is a good, perfect match. And you say, go ahead. Then the following day, you see them punching themselves. And then they say, they come back to that same pastor. Maybe you are the one that heard from God. Are you hearing correctly? Are you hearing perfectly? Let the Lord use you. If you are ready for him. This is the promise that is already said of the Lord. And God is not a man that he should lie. And it shall come to pass in the last days, says the Lord, I will pour out my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and daughters shall prophesy, and your young men shall see vision, and your old men shall dream dreams. Where are your dreams? Where is the prophecy? Let it come me. Where is the prophecy? Let nobody come and deceive you. Thank you, Father. What you are going through, the Lord told me to tell you, He will send somebody to you. Don't listen to that. They are coming to ruin your family. They are coming to break it down. Is God speaking to you? Do you know where they are telling lies? Do you know if it is a, 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 an enchantment? Do you know if it is a divination? Oh, this is God speaking. You said, oh, yeah, show me from this picture. Who is my wife? Oh, yeah, yeah, select for me. Which one? Are you sure this is this one? Is this one? 
You know, people will come, they say, please pray for us. And they say, go ahead, God has cleared every road. Nothing, nothing. And which is are there, you cannot even know. You can't identify. They are in our churches. You cannot identify them. My God. I tell you, it is a serious thing. It is a very serious, it is a very serious scenario. I'm telling you. The witch can just call and manipulate your leader. Manipulate your pastor, manipulate the group pastor, manipulate the head, manipulate everything. There are no sensation of the spirit of the Holy Ghost, the spirit of God. But that's why many are, being, are making mistakes. Many are crying in the secret place. But they cannot tell you the pain is much. The hunger is much. It's terrifying and it's killing. It's killing because they could not pay the price. Ask and it shall be given unto you. Have you had? But I've been asking all this while. If you have asked, you will receive. God cannot lie. That's one thing I can tell you. If it's not working, then you have not done it the way you say you should do it. Ask and it will be given unto you. He is your God, is your Father. He is not the God of the Zidonian and he is not the God of Dagon. He is still the God of the half. Is the ancients of days they are young that I am? I encourage you to please pray and pray more. We do not have enough time, but I tell you, go and find alignment with Christ and let Him pour out that spirit upon you. He will guide you, He will direct you, and you will not go astray. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Let me hear a thunderous amen. 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 There are a lot of prayer requests on the platform. We have a serious prayer request. But I tell you beyond the shadow of doubt that in the month of February, you will testify. Amen. In the amen. month of February, you will receive a touch from the Holy Ghost. In the month of February, there will be outpouring of his blessings. It's outpouring of his spirit in the name of Jesus. And that thing you are asking of the Lord, you will get it in the name of Jesus. Amen. In one sentence, I want you to bow down your head and begin to pray for all the requests. I have plenty and I have many, a lot of prayer requests I have here, but time will not allow us. But I tell you that according to the power that worketh in you, that request will come to pass in your life in the name of Jesus. So Amen. open your mouth and begin to pray, Lord. All the prayer requests we have on the platform, the one we have on the private, and the one we have on the public, that God will begin to answer them. There is one that is having heart pain and could not breathe very well. Open your mouth and pray that God will heal that person now and he will be able to breathe very well. Somebody that prayed that God should give her a better job, a good job. Some are praying that God should touch their children so that they will not be wayward and they will know God the more. Uh, and some uh, is Lord even Lord also Lord praying that uh, everything she has lost, as that God should restore them by request. restoration. Come, oh so God. please open your mouth and, and begin to pray for them. In this month of uh, in this in the month of February, there will be an encounter. There will be an encounter. To us in the name in of Jesus. Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Say it louder, Amen. Amen. Oh Lord, we thank you for this afternoon. We thank you because thank you, we know that your promise are sweet. They are yea and amen. Your promise yes, you will Lord. not fail. You are not your word more than your name. My God and my Father, release your heart pouring upon every participant and everyone that their heart are open to receive from you in the name of Jesus. Amen. No amen. family will be lacking of God's content in the name of Jesus. Holy Spirit, Amen. we want to know more of you. We want to see you. Say they that know their God will be strong and do exploit. We want to do exploit. You say, I know the thought I have towards you, they are the thought of peace and not of 